President Hahe Gengob was pronounced dead early today, barely a month after he announced to the public that he was being treated for cancer. He was Namibia's first Prime Minister after independence and was first elected President in 2014. He would later be re-elected in 2019. He was serving his final term because he was ineligible to run for re-election as Namibia's constitution limits the president to a maximum of two terms in office. And I call on all Namibians to participate in spirit of peace and unity. President Gengob had a history of health problems that preceded his election as Namibia's third president. In 2013, he underwent brain surgery and last year, he had an aortic operation in neighboring South Africa. Up until his death, he had been receiving treatment at Lady Pohamba Hospital in Vindok. Born in a village in northern Namibia in 1941, Gengop was the Southern African country's first president outside of the Ovambo ethnic group, which makes up more than half the country's population. In his early years, he took up activism against South Africa's apartheid regime, which at the time ruled over Namibia. However, in 1964, he was appointed representative for the Southwest Africa's People's Organization, officially known as the Swapo Party of Namibia, at the United Nations. He spent almost three decades in Botswana and the United States, returning to Namibia in 1989 to lead Swapo's election campaign in his now independent homeland. Namibia is to hold presidential and national assembly elections towards the end of the year. Just a quick wave.